Community Health Foundation launched free health care services for certain categories of people, including under five children, pregnant women, and lactating mothers. Linda Muxinsise is founder of this health initiative. This is one of our first um, medical facility we have established. So Community Health Foundation, again, let me just um, give you a little background. It's a healthcare organization that is providing help in the health sector. So this Malent One community you see here, this hospital here, is one of the health center Community Health Foundation has built. And, and it's running now, it's, it's operational. So that's why we call it Community Health Foundation Medical Center. So. So far, since we opened April 29, 2020, this is about the, our 10th month since we started working here. We're in partnership with the government through the Ministry of Health and Sanitation. They provide staff for us, like we have Nigerian doctors here that are that are working with us from Nigeria through the government. We, start, we just launched our free medical yesterday. Right now, we are providing free health care services to pregnant women, lactating mothers, and under five children. Over the years, the foundation has been providing medical supplies to hospitals across the country. The establishment of this center, according to Linda, has reduced many challenges to travel afar for medical services. For now, we've been doing different kind of surgeries. As we all know, the, I mean, the distance from here, Manitouan here to Maboka is far, and Maboka is the only government hospital we have close by, but it's really far from us, and the road is really bad. So because of that, People have been losing their lives here, trying to get to the government hospital. Like pregnant women, when they want to give birth, if they have complications, wearing with, they have to do surgery, meaning operation to remove the baby. They have to travel with them to Maboka. And the road is bad. Sometimes vehicles get stuck on the road, sometimes impossible to cross, especially in the rainy season. So since we opened this hospital here, so far we have saved a lot of lives. Because all of those pregnant women who normally go to Baboka to get health care, now they come to Community Health Foundation Medical Center right here in Manantuan. We do surgeries for them. For example, we do cesarean section, which means to get the baby out if the woman is not able to give um, natural birth. We do um, ania surgeries for men, both men and women. If they have ania, we do that kind of surgery. We do appendix surgery. We do fibroid. We do um, um, cyst. I mean, we do different kind of surgeries. Even bone. We do bone surgeries here and some minor surgeries like abscess and all that. So because of that, all the community here, the Manantuan community, Yonin, Malal, Mabela, Chief Dom, all of them come here to get medical care. For hundreds of beneficiaries, the humanitarian gesture is timely. They look to the left, they say that they will not fight. They give me medicine after that. I'm going to nurse. I'm going to take that medicine. I tell you somebody, I thank you. Without this opportunity, I tell her thank you. See, they see. I'm so excited and I'm glad it's so much because of this free medical way. And Linda, don't bring her for me. I'm 91. So, it's going to see when I see the medicine there. I'm glad you for me picking. So, now that they make a camp today and they don't give me medicine. So, if ever this facility will not be there, I will get the medicine there. I'm not sure how they get there. And I'm not the ever they feel good. So from the, this facility we in Camp Naya, so Alhamdulillah, for we then come brother and my 91 in particular. So now we they get super medicine the way in this say, you know, they even waste time with UPK sickness. When you give me, even if they get difficulty stuff for you pick any well body one. But now when they can't give medicine there, then they make sure say they protect the medicine there, then dry and they fine. Community Health Foundation is currently constructing a modern hospital in my 91 of which the support of government, health-related NGOs, and goodwill individuals is needed to complete this project. Abba Sisi, AYV News, Tonkoli District.